yo 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 what's up what's up this is your girl dot equilibrium actually all the way from london uk welcome yet again to my friday musings right before i start welcome to the month of april 2020 what can i say march is finished we're in the fourth month of the year what's going on around the world first of all march finished and in march there's been lots of stories about koro koro <laughs> yeah i said it koro koro so the whole world is shut down, the whole world is on lockdown because of Kurokuro. And it's interesting, you know, in the Western world, right, they have things they put in place, you know. So literally if I can't if I can't go to the shops or if I if, if I can't afford to go to the shops, they'll bring food stuff and groceries and amenities to my door front. Now in Africa, they've decided to social isolate and quarantine themselves. And you see my problem with that is as much as we're trying to slow down the virus in Africa but what have you put in place most places in Nigeria don't even have an isolation center Die. so what do you do with the sick people are you putting them in the same hospital with people that are sick oh my goodness Jesus. come on now you shut down the markets you shut down the borders you shut down everything how are they gonna feed look at this video all let the road for us make it gary party oh gary rise party come give us sickness and self never come now we go die now to in furthermore to to enforce and to enforce the isolation and the stay at home business in Nigeria. They put the soldiers on the street. You know what? When you put soldiers on the street, police brutality. Look at this video. What you need to do is to educate your people about washing their hands, social distancing and all that stuff. But for you to do that, you have to put things in place. I heard they're giving out money in Nigeria. However, look where the money is going to. <laughs> Out here in the UK, what's going on? People are going paranoid. People are losing their mind. Ah, I can't stay in the house anymore. Even people that have never exercised one day and say, we need to go out to exercise. Which exercise? You've never left the couch. Years and years and years. And now they say you should stay in the house. You want to go out? <sighs> oh my days. Guess what? Here in the UK, someone killed themselves. Why? Because they were afraid of getting the virus. Hey! Jesus, I hear me to are you serious? Me. You're not, you're not, you're, you haven't got the virus yet, but you were scared. You were paranoid about getting it, and so you talked yourself. <sighs> what can I say to that? The other day, a man stabbed his wife to death. There's been nine people totally dead in 10 days of isolation and lockdown in the UK. People are going mental and paranoid. Saying that, as much as we're trying to curb the virus and slow it down, we have a bunch of nutters walking about in the UK at night. They are <coughs> and touching your yes, hands and touching your car hey. and touching fruits in the shop. What the heck is wrong with people? How far do we hear of this? If the world is going to end, let's end now. Don't be the agent of death. Seriously. If you're sick, get treatment. Stay at home. If you want to die, die alone. Don't go around spreading this virus. But anyways, my people in church, so church people are under pressure now. After struggling and struggling and struggling, I say we must have church service. The word of God will prevail. The work of the Lord will prevail. So now there have been laws in place. The churches have had to shut down. Hey! This is a point where those that have always had online services, they're laughing. They're saying, this is the moment we prepared for. We always had online services. We never built synagogues and churches. But anyway, everyone now has an online church. And the first thing they're doing with the online church is to say to you, this is how to use the online giving portal. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. The first message of the online giving, on the online giving, because that's where it is. The first message of the online church is how to give. How to give. But anyway, they're giving online. So no church. Some churches are still adamant and they're still meeting. Some people still meet in the mosque. And obviously in Nigeria, what's happened? Because they stopped the meeting in the mosque, these people got angry in the north and they went to the police station and they burnt everything down. What do I say to that? You know. So in the month of March, Boris Johnson got sick and he's well. He's getting better. Prince Charles got sick as well. He's getting better. Idris Elba. <laughs> Idris Elba got sick. Even when he was saying he was sick, right? He had his wife with him. Several weeks of pressure about what's going on with the wife. Why was she there in the video? She's come out and made a secret phone call to our good old friend Oprah Winfrey. She was? Said she's tested positive as well. Wow. Now the good question is, when Idris Elba made his statement and said he was hanging out with someone who was potentially positive, or who tested positive for the COVID-19, he never told us who that person was. Was it a side chick? <laughs> <laughs> On a serious note, yeah, this is coronavirus period, uh, koko, koko, koro koro. in this koro koro period, like, let's take it easy. Let's do the right thing, okay? And let's look out for one another. Check up on your brethren, check up on people, see how they're faring. And you know, send a note, send something out there just to check on them. And at the end of the day, this two will pass away. So from me to you, all the way from London, welcome to the month of April. 
good things ahead stay positive keep your mind in the right place do not try to be a conspiracy theorist because no matter how much you try on facebook your your opinion doesn't count and you will never be a member of the fbi or cia so you know what leave negativity that you can't deal with and stay with positivity so that you don't start having nightmares everyone is dreaming of jesus coming and end times come on jesus has been coming since the beginning of time there's nothing happening now that's not already in the bible and it's been there for over two thousand years so don't let yourself be consumed with fear from me to you one love and if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. And I got merchandise as well. I still intend to feed families in need on the 12th of July. Or maybe sooner now because this coronavirus has left people in a lot of hardship. So, check out the merchandise. Let's do these people. Wonderful. On a more serious note, if you don't need to go out, stay isolated, stay safe, wash your hands, keep your immune system up, keep healthy, exercise, alright? One way or the other, we're all going to come in contact with this virus, or we already have. So what you need to do is, stay safe and stay prepared. Don't go out if you don't need to. Stay indoors. It's not that hard. And at the end of the day, as they say, this too will pass away. One love.